Today, a uh, less serious approach to money. I'll talk about a few ways you can win more or less substantial amounts of money in the UK. No premium bonds this time. I talked about them already in this video, so you can go and check it out. Also, no gambling, no spammy prize draws that will rob you of your personal details in exchange of a chance to win a packet of crisps. Simply a few ways you can win money almost as a result of a side effect. Shall we start? Hello, welcome to All The Honeys, the money YouTube channel that despite its name has nothing to do with erotica. I'm Marta and I'm very glad to see you here. On a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you love premium bonds? Most people I know love premium bonds. I personally keep my emergency fund in premium bonds. The thrill of winning is a big appeal and national savings and investments do know about that. But there are other ways to win decent money and the odds are much higher than with bonds. Especially if your stash is not in tens of thousands of pounds, as it's the case with premium bonds. My currently favorite one is the Halifax mortgage draw. I'm about to remortgage with Halifax and can't wait to be part of this monthly event. My mortgage broker didn't tell me about it, which I think is strange as it's a unique selling point. Anyway, I found out on my own and since I've told two of my friends who happen to have mortgages also with Halifax and whose mortgage brokers also didn't bother to let them know. And now it's your turn to find out. I will link to all the products in the description of this video, but let me tell you the general rules. You need to have a residential, not a buy to let mortgage with Halifax. Register for their mortgage draw and also have a bank account with either Halifax or Bank of Scotland. Now, similar to premium bonds, you need to have that account for a certain period before the draw. You also need to pay in, attention, 1500 pounds into that account every month. If all this sounds like a lot of hassle, think of the price. A mortgage the size of up to 300K could be gone forever if you happen to win. There are some other cash prices, but this is the big deal. And if you have a joint mortgage with your spouse or your partner, you increase your chances as long as each of you follow the rules. So each of you needs to have this bank account and each of you needs to register and so on. How good is that? In my view, absolutely worth the initial time investment. Funny enough, I wasn't able to open a current account with Halifax online, so I had to do it on the phone. You know all the legal stuff that you read online when opening a bank account and you agree to? Poor guy on the other end had to read it all to me, line by line. And agreeing ahead was just not permitted. I felt really sorry for him in those moments. Anyway, if you have a mortgage with Halifax or know somebody who does, register for the mortgage draw, open that bank account, put some money in there. There is a lot to win and absolutely nothing to lose. The nationwide member price draw. I'm recording this video still in July, but it will be published in the first week of August, so next week, when I will be away in Poland, which means I won't be able to re-record this bit and this deal will have expired by then. However, I think it is worth mentioning because it might come back in one shape or another. So let's go through it briefly and I will keep you updated in the description of the video. This one is very easy going. All you need to do is be what they call a nationwide member. What is a nationwide member? It means that you have a mortgage or a savings or a current account with nationwide. That's it. If you do, you're automatically entered. So this is where the easiness is. You can also opt out. Uh, who would want to do that? Of course, as always, there are some terms and conditions, but now that the deal is over, there is just no point mentioning them. Here's what you can win every month. 100K, one prize. 25K, two prizes. 10K, five prizes. Or 100 pounds, 8,000 prizes. I do hope Nationwide keep this show going as it's pretty excellent. And while we're here with Nationwide, let's mention their other draw. 
nationwide start to save. It's not as generous. You can win £250 every six months only. The next draw is in February 2023. The rules are a bit tedious. You need to put between 25 and 50 pounds in each of the six calendar months leading up to that draw. For example, to qualify for the prize draw on 21st February next year, the total balance in your account needs to increase by at least 25 pounds in August, September, October, November, December and January. The two good things about this draw are one, your odds of winning are quite high, depending on how big the prize fund is, between 1 in 34 and 1 in 67, which is really high. And two, even if you don't win, you still get some interest on your savings. Personally, I think this is a nice draw for people who are learning and starting to save up, as the name of the account suggests. It just gives you that sweet incentive to build a good habit for just another month and just another and another. Yorkshire savings account prize draw. Here's another prize draw connected to a savings account. This one is with Yorkshire Building Society. You know what? I never had a chance to bank with them. Maybe one day. This draw is connected to their Make Me a Saver account and it's very similar to the Nationwide's Start to Save, but it has slightly different rules and much better prices. The different rules are you need to pay in between 50 and 150 pounds a month so the amount is bigger but the draw takes place every month so not every six months like it is the case with nationwide and you can be one of the 10 lucky winners of 1500 pounds the idea is for the price to cover the average total of the most important monthly household bills and again if you don't win your money will still earn you some interest currently 1%. I know it's a pathetic figure, but hey, premium bonds earn you nothing. Let's move on to the final savings account price draw. Halifax savers price draw. You can tell I didn't want you to end up confused or asleep, so I moved this other draw by Halifax for later. This one is by far the closest equivalent of premium bonds. To qualify to enter, you need to keep £5,000 in a Halifax or Bank of Scotland savings account. Now, this could be in a single account or across multiple accounts, up to you. But again, Halifax will not make it easy for you, so you won't be automatically entered into a draw. You need to register. But once you do, you're giving yourself a chance to win 100K, free prizes, 1K, 100 prizes, or 100 pounds. 1500 prices. I know many people will say it's not that million you can win by owning premium bonds, but you know what? I'm sure that winning 100k feels as good as winning a million. Now, I didn't want this video to be too serious, so decided to add a few silly draws. The postcode draw. I read somewhere that this is an extremely popular type of lottery in the Netherlands. Well, it also exists in the UK. All you need to enter is a postcode and Remember to check if you won. The draws take place daily and the prices vary, but shouldn't go below 200 pounds. So enough to pay at least for your council tax. The birthday lottery. And finally, something very similar, but with very low prices. You can win five or 10 pounds. Normally I wouldn't be recommending it to anybody because of the size of the prices, but as I said, I wanted to add some fun draws and this one has such a ridiculously low point of entry that you might as well give it a go and win some coffee money. Speaking of coffee, you can buy me one on this page when you win one of those prizes I mentioned in this video. You're welcome. That is it guys. When I think of a draw, you should know these are the ones worth your while. Are you taking part in any of them? Have you won anything yet? Let me know in the comments. It would be fun to read that you actually did win something. I hope you found this video useful and I hope it will give you a kick to try your luck and sign up to at least one of those draws. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you soon.